Rourke here is your off the clock bartender bringing the art and science of craft cocktails to your home. In this week's video I will demonstrate how to make a classic old fashioned. This is perhaps the oldest cocktail in history. It is a spirit forward stirred and direct cocktail where muddled fruit is not welcome. If a drink doesn't have juice or dairy, stir it. Alright, let's go over the bar tools needed to construct this historical concoction. A mixing glass or the small tin from a Boston shaker works. A julep strainer or hawthorn strainer if you're using the small tin. A bar spoon, a jigger, a double fashion glass, a large ice cube tray, and a vegetable peeler. Alright, so with your mixing glass or your tin, let's add one small bar spoon of brown sugar and three dashes of Angostura bitters. You can find these bitters at most liquor stores or online. Next add two ounces of your favorite bourbon. Unless you're made of money, you don't need to spend a lot. We're going to stir this cocktail for about 15 seconds. Don't go nuts stirring too long. This cocktail shouldn't be ice cold. To stir properly, add enough ice to go just above the liquid. Hold your bar spoon between your ring and your middle finger. Pull with your top fingers and push with your bottom, trying to move only your hand. The ice should move as one unit. This technique is elegant and worth the effort. We are almost there. Let's add a single cube to a double fashion glass. Strain your cocktail using a julep strainer or a hawthorn strainer if you use the small tin of your shakers. The large cube is perfect. It keeps your cocktail cold, but not freezing. There is also little dilution because the single cube doesn't have very much surface area. To garnish this cocktail, you will need an orange and a jar of Luxardo cherries. Don't accept anything other than these Italian goodies. Add one and then peel a long strip from your orange. Respect the peeler. It will show no mercy if a finger gets in the way of your orange. Express the peel by folding it in half lengthwise. The orange zest takes this cocktail to another level. It is surprising to see how much oil shoots out of the peel. Wipe the inside of the glass and toss it in. And there you have it, the classic old fashioned. There's a full description of this cocktail written below. If you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. Tune in next week to learn how to make a gin fix, a prohibition era classic. Cheers.